This video is for anyone wondering about working with silver sintering materials. It will cover the roles of porosity and pressure. Dr. Lee, why work with silver sintering materials? Uh, this is because of the currently the industry is moving to the higher power device, uh, including the high speed train and also the converter, those kind of things. Uh, the conventional solder material no longer good enough, yeah, mm -hmm. such as uh, high lead solder or even other type of lead free material. They are not good enough in terms of thermal conductivity, electric conductivity, and also surface temperature. Uh, for all those reasons, silver is become a much better alternative to high lead, which no longer can do the job. Yeah. So That's why we work on the silver center material. Very good. Now there's a focus on low porosity. How does that fit in? If you let the porosity happen in the joint, it defeats the purpose. Porosity doesn't provide electric conductivity, doesn't provide the thermal conductivity, also doesn't provide good mechanical strength. Uh, unless you take it out, otherwise you are your connect, interconnect material is actually partially functional and partially reliable. That's why it's important to have a low porosity. Now, how does pressure factor into the equation? Uh, pressure is, is important in terms of the most uh, manufacturing cost. Uh, when you need to have a pressure during the central process, the whole thing slows down. Mm -hmm. Before one batch is finished, you cannot do the next batch. The whole thing becomes uh, fairly uh, sluggish and also for the equipment-wise, pressure bond is also expensive uh, on, the, on the cost. If you can allow the pressureless uh, central process, you can send the army through the oven, and uh, that's a very high throughput. Sure. And uh, this is why the pressureless is so important for the industry. Dr. Lee, where can we get more information on silver sintering materials? Uh, actually, on our website, we have a, a bunch of information on that, showing you about uh, where where you can get a better material on that and how they perform. Yeah. Very good. And of course, there's your blog and your excellent technical papers they can download. <laughs> Always try our best. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Lee, thank yeah. you very much. Okay. You're welcome.